Hello, I'm Firepuck. If you guys are new, welcome to my channel. Alright, so I got some more news for you guys from Respawn themselves. So there were a lot of, not hackers, but just glitch abusers running around in ranked, able to win ranked games very easily because using a heat shield, you can somehow do a glitch where it stays up forever in ring. Therefore, you can spawn in the middle of the map, or at the edge of the map, find a heat shield, simply place it down, do this glitch, and then sit there the entire game, not take any ring damage, and end up winning the game. This is obviously a huge problem for ranked, and people are able to gain a lot of RP very easily. So Respawn has said that they are going to be disabling the heat shield in ranked and private matches until the bug is fixed. Which is great, I'm glad they're doing that, because that's just absolutely stupid people who are able to do that. Also they said we're aiming to fix bugs with the heat shield early next week, so hopefully we can get a patch in by Tuesday, which is a normal patch date. Also, they say matches will be limited to two no-fill players per game. This simply means if you are no-filling into a game, whether it be duos or trios, you and one other person are going to be the only solo queuers in that entire lobby, so there will only be two solo queuers in each match, basically. I think before it was six, but whatever, this will work fine. I'm very glad they're finally fixing the heat shield thing. Heat shields have been super annoying and ranked nonetheless anyways, whether they were there or not. And overall, this event hasn't received a whole lot of good feedback. I think the event looked pretty cool to start hearing about what it was going to be like. I was pretty excited for it. But actually playing it in-game, it wasn't all that great. Not as fun as I thought it would be. But some of the devs have responded to some constructive criticism on Twitter about the event and said they are listening to the feedback. So that's good to hear as well. This is all I want to share with you guys in this news video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you all later.